Hey guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to connect to a web server using an FTP extension in VS Code on a Mac OS X. So here I have my web page open in Chrome browser, and on the left hand side I have my VS Code editor. On VS Code sidebar, go ahead and go to Extensions. Once you open it up, start typing FTP-simple into the search bar, and go ahead and click on the first search result. Now click on the install button. Once it's installed, go ahead and close all of this. Now press Command Shift P to open up the command palette. Start typing FTP simple and then select config FTP connection setting. This opens up our FTP configuration file. Go ahead and change the name to your website name. Enter the IP address of your web server that you would usually have on your web hosting control panel. By default, you have port 21 and FTP. You'll probably want to change that to SFTP for more security. So go ahead and type SFTP and change the port to 22. So change this to SFTP and port to 22. Now enter your username and password, which is a lot of the time is the same password you use for your SSH login directly to your web server. If you know the root folder of your web application or website, go ahead and type it here. Mine is located in var www semicolon dev. Now press command shift P once again to pull down the command palette. Start typing FTP dash simple. And this time select remote directory open to workspace. Select your web server name. Now on this drop down, select a folder that you want to link to your VS Code workspace. Now FTP simple is going to start downloading all of the files from your web server into your VS Code project. Now click on trust folder and enable all features. On the left hand side we have our web server files open so go ahead and browse to the file that you want to edit. Now simply apply changes to your file and hit Control S to save the file. FTP Simple is going to ask you to overwrite the file, so click OK on that. And now when I refresh my browser, you will see that the file has actually been physically changed on the web server. So guys, that's all there is to setting up your VS Code for FTP on Mac OS X.